I, I don't know if it's a filter or not, but uh Okay, I think volume wise I think it's fine. So this is what this is what they meant. Like the, the problem is like on, on a PlayStation game or whatever. This is pretty standard. The only issue here, maybe, it's like the, the volume can only be can only affect the music. It can't affect anything else, which is kind of annoying. Like it, like the like the volume section should be a lot more detailed. But other than that, like it's it's you know it it's mostly what it is. Um, <clears throat> the the issue is that it's the same menu for PC, and that's a problem because PC has a lot of like tweaking stuff that people are accustomed to. And so the fact that you can you can't change anything is kind of annoying for some people. So it is like a Zelda game, right? So like people don't talk. <laughs> Yeah, exactly. Yeah. The music is blasting. Why would you want to turn it down anyway? So exactly. True. Luna. Hi, Baldo. I knew you'd be here as always. I just saw your grandpa. He's looking for you. I'm so excited. I want to tell you what I found out yesterday. But before I do, let's hear what your grandpa has to say. It would be rude to keep him waiting. Okay. So pause is the menu. Inventory is this. Very Zelda-like. Menu is a bit laggy, like it just a, just a smidge. This outfit has been passed down from generation to generation. Wear the colors of the village of Kidoge or Kidoje. I don't know. Quests. Oh, cool. Okay. There's even a side quest section. That's cool. Memories. I don't know what that is. Hmm. Frame rate isn't super smooth. Like it, it works, but the frame rate isn't like super super smooth. Although keep in mind, this is this is like a 20 25 bucks game uh if you buy it. So it's not that big of a deal. Like, it's clearly an indie game, for sure. But it's so charming. Look at the graphics, man. It's like triple... Like, it looks like a Nino Kuni game. What? No, I don't need a new shovel, but it's very kind of you to ask, Baldo. Now, let me see. If you want to do something useful, I heard that Ms. Zira down at Kalo, Cabbage Patch, needs help. It looks like somebody stole some Kalo cabbage from the camp last night. Go down there and see if there's anything you can do. Okay, what do I mean I can? Why is there like a ray of light coming down from that? It's so hot today, I left my old shovel over there and started owing. I've been digging for such a long time but I don't think I'll be needing that shovel anymore. Okay, I, I missed, because I clicked too fast the first time so I missed the uh, dialogue. Hey, Index. Yeah? You think so? Before I go down there, I think I'm going to go inside the uh, the house first. Hey, Carton. What's up, man? Ah, Baldo, there you are. Listen carefully now, lad. I may have found what I've been searching for my entire life. The final resting place of the fabled Lost Galleon. It's right here in Kidoje. Can you believe it? I've been looking for this galleon everywhere, and it's been here all along, right under our feet. I know I've told you this story a hundred times, but indulge an old man. 
Long ago, a galleon came here carrying an incredible treasure, a weapon, an, in an inestimable artifact that could unveil the path to the legendary village of the Garden Owls. As it approached the coast, a terrible otherworldly storm enveloped the galleon and it disappeared into thin air. Along with all its treasures and crew, the storm was the last desperate attempt of the no-heart creature. Uh, okay. Sealed in the underworld by the Guardian Owls to redeem the weapon stored within the hold of the galleon. The entire crew fell, fell while trying to protect the artifacts from the, the tentacles of a huge terrifying monster that rose from the abyss. Legend has it that the monster is still protecting the cargo in the depths, but the story doesn't end there. The prophecy says that when the pure heart child is born, the no heart creature will rise again and only a brave heart will be able to stand against it. Okay, fairly standard fare. That's where the legend ends, but now I know where the entrance that leads to the lost galleon might be. I'm convinced it's inside the abandoned mine here in Kidoje. I saw the symbol of the guardian owls down there. I'll go and make sure later on this morning. Before that, there are a few more mundane tasks to attend to, Baldo. Miss Yadina told me this morning that two of her chickens have gone missing from her farm. Legends can wait for now, be a good lad, and go and talk to her. Remember, we all help each other in Kidoji Village. You wouldn't want to miss Yadina to be sad now, would you? She's a good woman. It's thanks to her we all have such good eggs every day. But I mean, if she's a good woman, then we'll help her, obviously. Okay. Yeah, I can talk to my friend, but I don't want to talk to her yet. What is that? What is that for? I hope it's not supposed to be pee, because it's kind of green-ish. There's a chest up there. How do I get up there? I can't. No, I can't grab the ladder, obviously. And that's a window. Okay. Let's see if there's a way to get like up there. Shows on known vibes. Ah, uh, kind of. Yeah, there's a way. See? Aha! Aha! Scadia Mushroom. The qualities of this mushroom have been known for generations. It is used to sprint faster for a short period of time. It grows everywhere in the world. Cool. The thing at the top there, is, are these like... Just to tell me I have new things? I think it is. Yeah, it is. So if I do this... They won't be there anymore, will they? Oh, it's the story I just read. Cool, he keeps it. The farmer and the sh old shovel. Okay, we, we've, we've talked to him before. Potion. If I select it, what happens? Oh, and now it's there and I can use it with circle? Yeah, no loot to say for me, man. I'm going to grab all the things. Oh, it's, it's just a bucket of water. That's what it is. Okay, I got to find, like, a woman. I think there's a woman, like, patrolling down there. Can I fall down? Let me, let me try here. I don't want to die. Yes, you can fall down, and it hurts, so let's not do that. I, I don't seem to have a weapon right now or anything. Can I pick this up? No. Hello, Baldo. Didn't you go to Savoka Prison with the other boys? I went to prison? Damn. Baldo's like a badass. Hey, Pyro, what's up, man? Yeah, I got two hearts left. Gotta be careful. Um, they asked me to come too, but I'd never go down there. After the, the cattle cabbage patch, it's dirty and dark and pretty scary too. There are legends about monsters on the way to Redijo Canyon, and I'm too young to die. Okay. So already there's a few things I can tell about the game. It, it, like, it's super charming. The music is super good. Um, really, really feels like a Ghibli. Like, it feels like a Nino Kuni game, just just like a Zelda game. Um, 
It just feels that way. Now, technically, though, there's a bunch of, like, technical difficulties. Uh, the way that the UI is done, it feels very alpha. It doesn't feel finished. Um, especially for the dialogue. Um, like, the, like, sentences that kind of end at weird places and, and they continue into the next bubble instead of, like, ending on, like, a dot and then going to the next bubble for, like, another sentence. Um, and the size of, like, the UI in separate areas is different than, than others. Also, there's a lot of stuttering. Like, when I run around, like, you can you can tell, like, it's not super smooth. Like, my um, my FPS is, is dropping a little bit. And I'm on PS5. This is a PS4 version, though, but it's... I'm playing on PS5, so you, you would think it would be better, but it's not super, super... It's probably... It's probably... Yeah, it's probably a hard cap at 30. Yeah, that's probably what it is. Hey, Steve, what's up, man? Hold on. I'm gonna shake it up a little bit. Because uh, uh, earlier I, I, I took a sip and it was like a uh, warm, and that wasn't super nice. That's a lot better actually. Yeah, that's that was that was nice and kind of refreshing. Um, how's it going? It's going good, man. I, I we just started. Nothing here. What is this? Hello, Cabbage Patch, this way. Savoka Prison, this way. Wait, do they both point here? This way? They both, they both point towards here? I'm not sure, actually. Okay, that's a Cabbage Patch, clearly. So the, the prison is either past the Cabbage Patch or it's someplace else. The game is super charming, though. I I really really dig the um, the aesthetics. Man, that frog is going ham. Can I talk to you? Hello. <laughs> this water is so nice. I love staying here on a hot day like today. It's so relaxing. Ms. Zira is so worried after what happened last night. I have to keep my eyes open. <laughs> Somebody's trying to steal our callow cabbage harvest. I haven't come across any clues yet, but who knows what you can find around here. I saw some animal running <laughs> around. I'm stuck here, but if I could get away, I'd catch one of them and sell it to the merchant of, on the dock of Rhodia. But I'm stuck here under Miss Ms. Zira's beady eye. So... Or Mrs., I should say. So wait. Where's this go? Redijo Canyon. I wish there was a... Oh, there is a... I was going to say, like, I wish there was a minimap. It's just because it's on the left. I'm not used to it being there. I'm trying to pull this thing out to help Miss uh, Mrs. Zira. The roots are too strong for me to get it out with my bare hands. But I'm not giving up. Okay. It's Wednesday, my dude? So it's not Wednesday. Are you kidding me? What's it, what is this game about? Uh, we just started. It, it, it's kind of like a Zelda game. But like with Studio Ghibli kind of graphics. But so far, like we just started. And, and what we're trying to do is we're trying to help out like a woman. She lost her chicken. Hide. You can hide in some bushes. Okay. Okay. Uh, Oh, because of the frog friend. Nice. Nice rock bar. No, I, see what, I see what you did there. What am I? Oh, it's a bird? Talk. Wait, no, I'll talk to her. I thought I thought I was trying to talk to the bird. I was like, wait, what? Where does this go? Push. Oh, can I? Wait. I can't, like, pull it? So I guess it can only be uh, moved from the other side, probably. Savica prison this way. Yeah, so one of the women lost her chicken. That one needs to move that fruit, but she's unable to do it. I'm assuming I need the shovel for that. That would be my guess. We don't have the shovel yet. Hmm. 
That's a big hole. Oh, it's her. Hello, I'm Mrs. Zira. I'm glad you're here. Someone sold some of our callow cabbage, and now we need to replace them to complete our harvest. I can't move away from here in case a thief comes back. I have to keep my eyes open. Do you want to help us? Great, but you'll need a shovel to do that. Go and see the farmer near your house and tell him I sent you. I'll lend you, he'll lend you a shovel. You can be sure of that. Okay, so now we can talk to the guy to get a shovel. Okay. Yeah, there's like a rice farm, you're right. But apparently it's cabbage. Maybe, maybe they, they have like special like underwater cabbage. Like, how, how far does this go? Here? Okay. Um, can I can I cross here? I cannot. Okay. So the only other thing I can do is climb up here. Oh! Ha-ha! <laughs> Loot will not hide from me. Made from dried bug wings mixed with a touch of catnip flavoring extracted from river silt. A dust bag, okay? Throw it on an enemy to stun it for a short while. It's a great way to start a battle. Anything here? Not really. Okay. Just making sure. Okay, so now we can get the shovel. So we should probably do that. Another spot where you can hide. And another turnip. Hey, some of the 50 bits. Thank you so much. That is so very kind. Thank you. Oh, did I forget to... Hold on. What am I doing here? Okay. Yeah, let's get the, uh, let's get the shovel. We'll come back and we'll, we'll get the two turnips. Uh, wait. It wasn't up stairs, was it? Pretty sure it wasn't. Pretty sure it was this way, wasn't it? Wait, no, it wasn't here. Who's that dude? Yeah, it, it, it's not a message. It's the uh, it's an alert to tell me you have a new side quest. <clears throat> um, but but I know what it is. But I mean, I, I'll I'll take it. So it's not in the screen anymore. I did watch uh, Gamescom. Yes, I might have missed some parts of it. I don't think so, but I might have. I'm not sure if I watched the entirety of it. Hello there. Welcome to Mini Minizio's Map Shop, purveyor of the finest maps in all the land. I'm Minizio, the cartographer. I just got back to Kidoji village after my last expedition. I must have explored every nook and cranny of this land by now, and I've made a map of every single area I've been to. A, a long and arduous task, believe me. I've faced untold dangers, dodged countless traps, and encountered strange and terrifying creatures like the Kangmi in Leone Heights and the Sand Snakes in the Marui Desert. You have no idea what outlandish things are out there. But there are also wonderful places, breathtaking views, secret locations, and ancient ruins. All manner of fantastic things. Have I piqued your curiosity? I do hope so. Please accept a complimentary map of Kidoji Village on the house. Just this once, I'm afraid. You'll have to pay for your next map, but it's a fair price considering all the efforts I put into producing them. Maps won't show you everything, but they'll certainly help you keep track on your quest, of your quests. Each map is a piece of a large puzzle, and you'll need all of them eventually if you want to unravel all the mysteries of this entire land. Finding your way around a huge world like this can be tricky without a proper map. Winnie! Thank you so much! Five months, dude! Oh my god, has it been five months already? That's insane! I love your face, man. Thank you. Thank you so much. Get us some hearts and chat for Willy. I would appreciate it. Willie's a absolute beast of a man. Oh, thank you so much, Sub, for the 50 bits again. You're the best. Thank you. Um, I have shops all over the, the land. Just follow the red mushrooms, like the one that le led you to the shop. 
I mean, to be fair, no mushroom let me here. I kind of like stumbled upon you, but I, that's fine. I'm going to take note that, you know, you're, you're where the mushrooms are. You'll see them growing on the ground and on rocks. When you see them, follow the path to my shop. Here, take this note to help you remember. Oh, cool. Wow, the map is huge. Look at the map. The Cabbage Patch field we were in, and that area we're in right now, that's just this small part of the entire thing. Wait, what am I looking at here? I, I don't know what I'm... Show map. Aha. Dude, this is huge. Yeah, that's going to be a pretty big world. Okay, I'm done with this. This is cool. Sir. Sir. I need your shovel. Give, give me it. So I was right. Mrs. Zira needed help. Good. Baldo, please take my shovel. I don't need it anymore. It's too old for me. One man's waste is another man's treasure. If you dig around uh, where you see small patches of soil like this, you might find something useful. Just try digging when you find a patch of soil. There's an old shovel... An old... But sturdy shovel, despite its simple look and its age, it still works very well. You can dig in soil whenever you think something might maybe hidden on the ground. What do I what do I equip it? Do I Oh, so you can have either a potion or the shovel. There's no like or or another quick weapon. Oh I see! Oh, that's useful. Okay. I see. That's pretty nice. Hold on, guys. Battle time. I'm going to guess I can't... I still can't do a stream marker. Am I right? They're completely broken on my account. I can't do stream markers anymore. Willie, do you think your next stream... You could try and do a stream marker for me? On your stream? And that way I would know if it, like, if it works for you. Or if it... Is completely busted. Stream markers are uh, they kind of like uh, they uh, so whenever you you go into like uh, the highlight section in your video, uh, uh, you, like with Twitch, you have like a, a video editor kind of thing built in, and you can create highlights of your own streams. That's how I cut up I cut up my episodes for YouTube, uh, and. Whenever you click on the marker, it should put a marker on the timeline of that specific stream for that specific moment. And I know, like, at that point, I had a stream editor battle, for example, or something. And that way I can cut it out for when I go into when I make the episodes. But because I can't click on it because it's busted, I have to, like, manually search the, the, the video and find all the bits where I played. Uh, stream editors and remove them. It's kind of annoying. I mean, it's it's feasible. It's not the end of the world, but it'd be nice if like if it was fixed, so I could you know 